Hey everybody, happy Wednesday. Mark Cosby here from Black Cat Comics and Rockin' Milpitas. Every Wednesday is New Comic Day and I like to give you some great reasons to get down to your local comic shop and pick up something fun to read. It's a pretty small week all in all, but a lot of great books to talk about. Some of my favorites, some of your favorites. Original Sin, number four. The big Marvel event book going on right now. Super huge, everybody's into it. Pick up zero through three if you've been missing out on that one. Two tie-ins, Nova your Outer Space Marvel Book of the Week, and Avengers 31 rounds out your original Sin stuff. Cool Black Widow cover there. Avengers World is your other Avengers Book of the Week. This one's been picking up a lot of steam for the last couple issues, so you should jump in on that and see what all the hubbub's about. Thor, God of Thunder, another book we've been talking about for a long time. You know, this one's self-contained, great story, great art, so if you're looking for something new, check out Thor, God of Thunder, because that book's awesome. Daredevil by Mark Wade. You know I love anything from Mark Wade. You know I love Daredevil. And his dead ex Electra also out this week. Part of the all new Marvel Now stuff. Iron Man and Iron Patriot are your Iron Books of the Week. Punisher. Another one of the uh, red hot all new Marvel Now books. Good to see him back in the Marvel Universe proper. And speaking of good old Frank, there he is on the cover of the new issue of Thunderbolts. New story arc. This is your jump in point. You can read more about that in our newsletter this week. Silver Surfer, number three. Another surprise, huge hit from Marvel. Uh, Mike Allred, stellar art as always. Reprints for one and two are still available. Had a pretty good X-Men week. This is Uncanny X-Men, my second favorite behind all new. Brian Michael Bendis doing a stellar job with all that stuff. Wolverine and the X-Men. And X-Men, which should be called X-Women, is rounds out your Marvel stuff this week. Pretty good sized week for the DC guys. Batman Eternal, your weekly Batman book. Going to mention it every single week because it comes out every week. Good stuff. Scott Snyder, you should be checking that out. Batman and Robin. This one's Batman and Rachel Ghoul rounds out the Batman and Robin stuff. One of the bombshell covers for this week right there. Along with this one, that's your bombshell cover to Batwoman. Super cool. And the one you've been waiting for, that's Harley Quinn. And that's your bombshell cover to Harley Quinn. These aren't necessarily variants, but they're going fast. So you're going to want to get down to your local shop and pick them up. Because they're super cool. Wonder Woman from Brian Azzarello. Another Women of the DCU Week books. This one's really solid. Also has a bombshell cover. Supergirl, the book I've been talking about for a while. C continues the Red Daughter of Krypton stuff. Read more about that one in our newsletter. Pandora, it's your Trinity of Sin book this week. That stuff will be wrapping up soon. Red Hood, with your cool Starfire bombshell cover there. And New 52, Future's End. This is your other DC Weekly book. This is the other big hit they've got going on right now. Got all the issues in stock, including the free Comic Day one. So get up on that, because it's been really, really cool. New Guardians is your Lantern book this week. And Fables, everybody's favorite Vertigo book. You know, I've been waiting for that one. That one will also be wrapping up pretty soon, which makes a lot of people very sad. Big week for my friends at Dark Horse. You know I always like to start with Mike Mignola stuff. This is BPRD. Got to read BPRD. Abe Sapien, Lobster Johnson, and of course Hellboy in Hell. Mike Mignola is awesome. Star Wars, Darth Maul, number two. <clears throat> Excuse me. You know I'm always talking about the great job Star Wars does with, or Dark Horse does with their Star Wars stuff. Got number one. Grab number two. Everybody loves the Sith Lords. And Buffy is your Whedonverse book of the week. You know I love the Whedonverse stuff. Cool week for the image, guys. The Wicked and the Divine is your number one first issue gotta have it book of the week. No, you've been waiting for that one. It's got three covers. So go to their website and find the cover that's right for you. Alex and Ada from one of the Lunar Brothers. You know I love the Lunar Brothers. Been talking about this book for a while. Cool sort of sci-fi romance title. Got a black cat pack for what will be the first volume, one through five. That's number seven. Good stuff. NMPH is your other gotta have it image book of the week. Because Mark Miller's always huge. Star Wars, or Star Trek, sorry, is the IDW book this week. City on the Edge of Forever is cool uh, Warren Ellis script. So that's, or I'm sorry, Harlan Ellison script. So that's always cool. Red Sonia, 
my Dynamite Book of the Week. Don't talk enough about the Dynamite guys. They have a huge line of great titles, so if you don't ha have one on your list, you should. And last but certainly not least, it's a huge week for the All Ages books. Always encouraging you guys to find an All Ages title to have on your list, and this is a great week for it. Simpsons. You know I love the Simpsons comics and the great job Bongo does with all their great stuff. Bill Morrison is super awesome. Archie is getting a lot of attention lately. You should definitely be checking out the new book. You should be looking for Life with Archie magazine because good stuff going on there. A couple of cool DC kids books, Teen Titans Go and Scribble Knots with a cool kids version of the question there. DC has a lot of cool kids books, so check those out. Regular Show, one of my personal favorites. Love the show, love the comic. These guys are doing a great job with all of that. My Little Pony is your favorite. It's cool, man. You can admit it. Samurai Jack, another fantastic all-ages book. Just as good as the show. Samurai Jack's always awesome. And The Powerpuff Girls, also always awesome. Told you it was a big week for the kids' books. Lots of great titles this week, so check those shipping lists. Get down to your shop. Pick up something super awesome. That's all I got for you for this week. Check us out at blackcatcomics.biz. Check us out at Facebook. Check us out on our cool YouTube channel. Or just get on down here to Rockin' Milpitas. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next week.